Joyce, he is. This 14-year-old boy is charged as a juvenile. He's facing five felonies, including hit and run and reckless injury. And according to court documents, he told investigators he wasn't even there when the crash happened. The stunning video shows a car crash into a school bus May 1st outside Morse Middle School. Now prosecutors have charged a 14-year-old boy who they say was behind the wheel. He's charged in juvenile court, so 12 News is not naming him. Lots of screams, children crying. It, it was scary. Video from that morning shows a 15-year-old boy hanging out the passenger side window at the point of impact. A witness detailed in court documents says she tried to help him after the crash, saying, quote, there was blood everywhere. His whole face and head were covered in blood. That witness says the boy, now charged in the case, tried to push past her and began pushing on the boy's shoulder, yelling, come on, come on, repeatedly before running off. My first thought was, what is going on? Meaning, what are they thinking? After the crash, prosecutors say the 14-year-old boy posted on Instagram, writing, he good, he has a praying family, and when I saw your face, I almost passed out. According to court documents, police found the boy's clothing inside his Milwaukee home near a washing machine. They also say they found gun magazines in his bedroom closet. The boy says he was not in the car when it crashed. The court document says he woke up and heard about it, then drove to the school and saw what happened. Kristen, the boy faces five felonies right now, but those charges could change. Joyce, that 14-year-old boy could face more charges if the 15-year-old passenger dies. His family says that his injuries include a crushed skull, a fractured arm, and a brain bleed.